Hi Cancer, it's Elle here to do your November mid-monthly reading. Uh, it's a general reading, so it will not resonate with each and every Cancer who views the video. But if it does resonate with you, uh, please go ahead and click that like button. Subscribe to the channel. It's much appreciated. Request a personal reading. Um, let's get started. Let's see what Cancers are. I saw for Forgiveness, End of an Era, the Strength card. It just looks like Cancer is going through transition and has been going through this whole transition for a while. I heard that somebody's scared. Scared of what the family dynamic will say or has said about um, a situation or about you making a change. You've done it before. You don't want to look foolish. You do not want to look foolish, but um, you know you want to make a change with something it could be work it could be relationship changes is where you are um, in your journey let's see um, some of you feel like you're energetically waiting for someone else but then they're but then they're waiting for you also cancer Okay, let's see. Messenger of air. Some of you could be dealing with Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Someone has has walked away from a union, a situation. I'm hearing someone gave some unspoken truth. So someone did something. It was in haste. And it closed the door. A cycle. It made you become the nine of fire. Wonder if you should even continue this. Because it's been nothing but strain. You've gotten your, your heart hurt. Your feelings hurt. There's it hasn't panned out well for you. Ace of Air. Looks like you may have some victorious new start. A new start. Once you communicate clearly about how you feel in regards to. In regards to you making a decision that you are possibly um, hesitating making. Because it's gonna, it hurts. It hurts another party. It solidifies and... Um, clarifies to the other party or to you that there was always something or someone else in the midst of anyhow even within this this um this communication and these hurt feelings you feel like your fortune is tied into this it's supposed to happen seven of air Yeah, it's like some truth. Some, let's see. Four of... No. Someone was sneaking around. Maybe with an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. They have... You have a family cancer. Somebody else has a family. I don't know. Um... Now they're in contemplation about what to do next. I don't, I don't feel like they're in communication with this person. Or they're not interacting with the other person right now. Either you, Cancer, or the person you're dealing with. The Seven of Water. Um, they fantasize about the options they have. About newness. About This could be the cheating spouse. The, the person who makes promises just to break them. This could be Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. This could be your husband, Cancer. Or you could be the husband that does this. Yeah, it could be an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is typically Aquarius or Libra. They fantasize about wow, the Queen of Water. About someone else who possibly has children. Or their partner to you, Cancer. 
and or are in fantasy and holding back their emotions about how they really feel stand in their ground this could you cancer standing your ground towards some fire sign or trying to make your way to wish fulfillment or some Aquarius person holding deep thoughts and a deep longing for a particular person maybe from your past or someone you've established something with cancer um, you want to take the leap of faith with this person yeah um wow leap of faith it definitely could be an Aquarius or an Aries you want to move away with this person you want peace serenity a real relationship you're working hard to getting that to try to manifest this you're being patient and waiting because you know that this is a relationship that you should wait for because it it complements you well you're holding on to this person some of you is a Sagittarius person right um, holding on or waiting for enlighten, enlightenment in regards to maybe an already established relationship that you're in with this maybe with the Capricorn or some relationship that is draining you, that is toxic, that is codependent, that is um, negative, that is of a lower vibration, that you feel like you've outgrown, that you feel like there's imbalance. You've got to make a judgment call. Are you in or out? Do you have the strength to um, put yourself first and put what you want first with the six of fire? Go after what you desire. Wow, and do it quickly, maybe with a fire sign. Um, take action. Um, move and cut away from, this might be an abrupt cut. Wow, an abrupt, it's a message of wanting to divorce, separate, because there are problems in this marriage or long-standing relationship. This could be a second marriage or a second relationship that you want to end that, that has caused you devastation. It could be with an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Ten of Earth. Some of you want to take what you have built with this person and and some of you are trying to take what you have built up for yourself and offer it to a secret something you're trying to like secretly move forward here is you cancer or offer something to someone in secret wow yep and then have the energy the motivation to chart a new path with the two of fire not knowing which way to go wanting to choose the right make the right decision opposition is here but it looks like the tower comes in and helps you tear down an old foundation so that you can start anew with the ace of earth this is a new tangible start one that you can build upon for time to come wow then the page of fire talks about going a new direction um, the new start the motivation to move away from you could be dealing with a younger fire sign, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, someone of a different culture, someone who dresses well, someone who's charismatic, outgoing. Um, you want complete transformation with this person. You want things to completely change. However it's been, you you want to walk away from from the old way of doing something you're hoping and wishing wow for communication you're manifesting also you know that this two of cups relationship while trying to move away from 
and get away from something that just doesn't serve you. Could be job, could be relationship, have motivation to do so. Uh, but there's high anxiety. This is either you or another person. Okay, this is you. High anxiety because you want to offer something solid and stable to someone from your past who you feel is a soulmate, who you have nostalgic, very good thoughts of, who you want to, you want them to be able to see your situation in a different light, Cancer. You want them to see the a different perspective of you. You also may not be doing much in bringing about this change. Just kind of letting things happen as they will. Someone may be being very cold to you or has, they want the truth about what it is you want. What do you desire or who do you desire? It looks like you desire to walk away. Or some air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius desires to have divorce, separation. Because it brings them to a place of, and it might be in this month, brings them to a place of peace. Of steel, of being on the right path. Though they don't know how to go about it, though the thoughts go back to how do I move forward. Either you, Cancer, or someone else wants to separate. Have a complete change, a complete move, a home move. Away from the King of Earth. Someone wants to have a complete change. And put time, energy, and effort. Someone had a career change. No, yep. Had a career change. Someone wants to walk away and put energy, time, and effort into themselves. Go after their heart's desire. Who could be another individual? Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. Because they've abandoned one path and are trying to get to who they deem as the Empress. If someone's walked away from someone that they put on a pedestal because it was way too burdensome. They carried the burden for as long as they could, but they've had realization, you know, an epiphany about the inequality in a relationship. Now they want reconciliation, good vibes with good people, even in the midst of indecision, fighting, arguing interference lots of change happening yeah five again you feeling lack lackluster feeling like there is no hope for for some yeah feel like there's no hope with an outside individual a very independent person Feeling like, yeah, like you've missed an opportunity. Cancer feels like an opportunity has been missed. Or your partner feels like there's an opportunity that has been missed. Or has a, a business opportunity, which is making them restless and bored. Or feels like they have missed an opportunity to offer, to have this change. Another five. Um, and offer something solid, stable, and traditional. The investment of uh, of their their feelings, their emotions, a real relationship, because they made either the choice. Just wanted to come out. Yeah, they've made the choice. They 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 are weighing up a choice. Cancer is weighing up a choice of who to actually partner to. Who to start over with? They go within in regards to 
who do they really want as their wife or a husband let's get some butterfly oracle cards in here take the next step now for my cancers windfall that's nice you're stronger than you know gracefully aging grief work under the deck leaving I swear everybody's getting leaving to them take the next step now windfall you're stronger than you know gracefully aging grief work leaving what we're going to do is clarify these cards over at my website it's going to be one dollar fifty cent to get um the extended reading to get a potential outcome this is exactly how cancer feels or how the partner feels or whomever um we're going to see what happens on the other on the other side so go ahead and click the link one dollar fifty cent to get a potential outcome i hope that this reading gave you a bit of clarity as to where you are we're also going to see how the other person feels it looks like somebody's trying to get to or get over anyhow um cancer know that i'm praying for you pray for me as well take care guys